Recently, there's been tons of talk about Hagia Sophia or Hagia Sophia, and these headlines say that it's a cathedral being converted into a mosque. Now, this is factually untrue and sensationalizing something to fit into the West versus East narrative. Let's re-examine the history. So Hagia Sophia was a cathedral built in the 6th century in Constantinople. This cathedral was actually looted and burned, not by Muslim Turks, but by 13th century Christian crusaders who completely sacked the city, weakening it so bad that it never recovered and led to its fall to the Muslim Turks in the 1400s. There are conflicting resources about this, so it's unclear whether or not Sultan Mahmoud II bought the building, but he did repurpose it into a mosque. It was used as a mosque for 500 years until the first president of modern Turkey turned Hagia Sophia into a museum as part of a ruthless campaign to westernize Turkey. I am not an expert. But my personal opinion is that it would have been more fair and harmonious to keep it as a museum. And that this whole thing is a politically motivated move. That being said, I think all of this has been completely overblown by the media. And it's perpetuating this East versus West and Christian versus Muslim battle. The fact that the media is so selective, talking about this, but never talking about all the mosques in Spain that were destroyed or converted, is also very hypocritical. Forget about historical. Let's talk about how Israel destroys religious sites in Palestine today. During the bombing on Gaza, 73 mosques were completely destroyed, in addition to three churches, one of which is a thousand years old. Al Ahmad Mosque, a 13th century Palestinian mosque, was converted into a bar. Let's think about why the media is so selective in attacking anything related to Islam while forgetting the West's colonial past and present. 